and there's the Greater Beckley Christian Nation showing out for their Crusaders getting ready to take on Tug Valley. We'll pick it up in the first quarter. Chance Potter bounces it to Caleb Clark who drives inside and pushes up for the layup. Crusaders trail 5-2. to two. Later, Potter bounces it to Clark again. He'll swipe past the defense for two. Next, Jay Moore dribbles inside, spins, and finishes with a one-handed layup. Crusaders catching up 11-10. to 10. Panthers respond. Tyler May drops back in the quarter and drains it for three of his game-high 28 points. Second quarter, a pass to Jaden Fisher, and he'll shoot big from the outside and knock it down for three. Third quarter, Moore pushes his way inside and floats it up for two. Crusaders trail 45 to 29. Next, Potter to Fisher, and he'll hit another three for the Crusaders. But Tug Valley responds with this three from Brady Newsom, and the Panthers go on to win final score 83 to 52. Here's Greater Beckley's head coach, Brian Helton, after their loss. You know, we, we just talked about some of the areas that, uh, you know, we've done well at all year that we didn't do well tonight, and that's uh, rebound the ball. And uh, they did a good job stopping our transition, letting us get out early in our transition. And then, you know, I think some of it, too, it's a, the it's a first time on this stage for most of our guys. We're young. Um, you know, we lose uh, two seniors, and um, these guys will all be back. So, um, you know, that could have played into it early. But, uh, you know, I, I, I was proud of our fight. I was particularly proud of our third quarter effort. I don't think our guys quit all night. I, think, I don't think we hung our heads and we kept plugging along. It just wasn't our day today.